be in shorts and a t-shirt. Tackle. There's a great shot. That was a curveball. There it is! Yeah, that might have been the furthest one. Oh, that's juicy. Coming from the side, Zach. Nice kick. And those misses tugged at my hamstring. Yeah, right there. <laughs> when I connected, nothing hurt. All right, I'm going to dial it up to 100 here. I might be removing myself from the game. Yep. I grew up playing cricket. Get out. I got rocked. I got rocked. Good game, good game, good game, good game. Good game, good game, good game. There it is. Yep. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in to the vlog, getting all our pre-draft strategy. I'm gonna tell you all about my draft strategy, Zach, because I'm a little worried about it. First, I gotta tell you about Cushy Dreams. Cushy Dreams has worked with us for a little bit now. It's smokable CBD. You can get this little uh, can or you can get a pre-roll. The pre-rolls, Jake and I smoked those in the back alley one day. <laughs> Smells like marijuana, tastes like marijuana. It's not marijuana, it's just the CBD. There's like 0.03% THC, so it's not gonna get you high. It's not gonna get you arrested if you live in a state that hasn't woke up yet. And you're gonna feel like you're smoking. It's for everyone out there that's kind of quit the real stuff, but which wants the CBD, which still has great effects. It helps with anxiety, depression, just helps you relax. My wife likes it to relax. So go pick up yourself some smokable CBD from cushydreams.com. It's K U S H Y dreams.com and use promo code JOHNBOY for 20% off your order. Go relax, go relax a little bit. Now time for me to be a little stressed, Zach, because the draft today, decades plus countries. I'm jealous that you get to hear everyone's strategy. It's a little bullshit. I have, can I tell you mine? You're not gonna? I haven't told anyone anything okay. in any of these drafts. All right, so if I get the number one pick, I'm taking the United States in the 80s. 
cocaine abounds, AIDS, HIV didn't exist yet. There's no real war going on. It was just like disco and drugs and partying. The economy was pretty good. People were getting jobs. Like, US in the 80s is my A number one. I think whoever gets the first pick has to take the US. I'm just wondering what decade they're gonna attach to it. I know Jake is a big fan of the 20s and the 50s. So, and the 80s. Jake likes 20s, 50s, 80s. So, that's North America. Now, if the US gets snaked for me in North America, I really want Cuba in the 50s. Right before Castro shut it down, Havana, it was just like party central. You know, you went to Cuba and you just smoked cigars and party. I really want that. If both of those, I don't want Cuba in any other decade. You know what I mean? So if I go US 80s and then Jake takes France in the 50s, I don't think I'm gonna go Cuba in another decade. So I'm, that's where it's like, well, how much can I climb? Um, I only have one for South America. I just took, I chose, I chose Brazil. And then I just found out years that they won the World Cup. I was like, that'd be cool to be there. Um, my other big hitter that I want is I figured no one was gonna take the 40s because it's World War II, but Switzerland didn't partake. They were like the one country that was like, nah, we're good. They kind of like brokered peace between the two. So they kind of like got all the scoops, like the Axis hit Switzerland up, Allies hit them up. They prepared to be invaded and then it never came. So like, that's a cool time. Like imagine the whole world's at war, but we're just chilling. So that's another one I want. New Zealand in the 2020s, kind of the same reason. They didn't really have COVID issues at all. They like persevered after a month and went back to normal while the whole world blew up. Uh, Egypt in the 2490s. I just want to see how those pyramids were built. Like getting to see the end. Like you saw like the last couple years of construction so you know how it happened and just see the final. So I don't know. I've, BBD said he's not choosing a single from after 1900s. So is he just chasing wars? Cause I don't really get that. Um, so it seems like maybe he's not even stealing from me. So I am, uh, I'm, I'm very happy with the ones I just named. I just don't think I'm gonna get any of them. Okay, today, probably the most difficult draft to prep for, because um, you can get snaked pretty easily with the double removal stuff, decade and country. And But I think I know, I'm happy with where I landed. I think I know where I'm gonna go with my first round pick. And it's a couple, and I'm between two countries, and one of them I'm, sh I'm reasonably sure will be there. And I'm comfortable with a few different decades there. And I know I'm thinking about it differently than, than at least Jimmy is. Jake is hard to read, but um, I think I'm prepared for my down ballot picks. The second round pick, whatever that ends up being, that's the one I'm like the least prepared for. But uh, we'll see where it lands. I'm excited. There she is. Is that me? Well, pleasure having you on the program, and we wish you the best in in what you're trying to accomplish in terms of the awareness of the music. Vibes. That you're trying to is Jimmy in the bathroom? Is he spying on me? Wow, we got a spy, huh? I can't be trusted here. Let's go. We're in the hallway. Zach, people, I am a mess. This draft is going to be ugly. They're talking about it right now. I, uh, my last Google search was when did Europe party? <laughs> I don't even know where I was going. I was thinking about techno music and stuff. I, uh, I'm gonna go guns a blazing on JJR and Peacock like I have a plan. I have nothing. I'm Googling FIFA World Cup champions. I got nothing. I got nothing. I, uh, I don't know. I think I could use US in the 90s early or something like that. You need one winner, but otherwise I'm just hunted, man. I got nothing. <laughs> Let's go. Zach, if you had to rank the game plans you heard from us. 
I haven't. I can never do that. This is the first time I've mm. not told Zach any specifics, I think. Wow. Well, how's it feel to be so distrusted? Yeah. Still know the strategy. I gave you yeah. every pick. I gave Zach. That's true. Everything. Jake might have revealed the most. We'll see. I mean, I read you my entire sheet. Actually, I did give yeah, you. Yeah, but. I I, gave, there's, I nothing gave more I, there's nothing more I could have revealed. Mm -hmm. Did he tell you he loved you or something? Could have revealed that. Uh, something came from the heart. I'll say that. Could have revealed yeah. that. I, with my third pick, I am going to take New Zealand in the now, the 20, 2020s. Also on my board. Let's go! Yeah, that was that was. I was gonna I was take prepared to whatever go you think you are. I am. I was going to take that number next. two in that in that continent for yeah. me. Zach, first people are telling me to wear these glasses lower. I think mm. that's supposed to be the Jim Morrison, Ozzy Osbourne. Uh, Zach, what do you think? What do you think of the draft? Seems like there was a pretty overall understanding that you wanted. You saw my pre-draft strategy. Mm -hmm. There was kind of never a doubt. <laughs> we did. We we played. The car ran real good. Duh, I couldn't find a decade that I thought would be an instant win for Britain, even though Alistair was saying you know Thatcher came around then and kind of fucked everyone in Britain. But the six, I couldn't find a decade that I thought the general public would be like, yeah, that's it. And Jake found it. 60s for UK. Um, other than that, I'm ju I just got snaked. Like, I just the order kind of fucked me. I, the one pick was going to get the US. I think that was the easiest path to. And then getting the wraparound after. So Jake did really well with his slot. I was excited that he had uh, New Zealand 2020s and Australia 2000s. Because that's, we that's the same as I had. I just didn't get them. Yeah. Pretty good. In hindsight, I think I would have felt right. I think I would have had the right idea going in if I had taken the number one pick, and I think I still could have gotten Japan with the with that second round pick. Um, oh yeah. I think I, yeah. Yeah. But I didn't I didn't want to risk not That's getting a, that. It might have not gotten the decade though. We didn't take an Asian com country. That might eat you up. So you could have had U.S. What decade would you have chose? Nineties. And then you could have had your, the your Japan yeah, the next round. I probably could, would have. But maybe I wouldn't have gotten the Not decade. probably. You would have. <laughs> Japan wasn't on my board. Yeah. But I don't think I would have gotten the decade. What decade did you want? Oh, that's I wanted true. A, I wanted that's one true. of the last. I wanted a 2000s or later. I think that would have that would have for I think sure been gotten it. I think I would have. That would have been solid. I'm going I'm to like, beat myself up over that. And I still got Australia, which you pro I think you would have gotten with the second round pick if it came back around. No, I was saving those. I didn't think you guys were going to snake them. Mm -hmm. Okay. Switzerland was going to be my number two no matter what. My number one was going to be Cuba or the U.S. Cuba was a strong play. That wasn't on my board. But I like what you did with it. Because I was also trying to feel that emotion yeah. of 1950s Cuba. Unbuttoned shirt. Sure, yeah. Times like are good. I mean, if you just Google 1950s Cuba, that's what I did. The Google images are like <laughs> yeah. a good time. You're dancing. Rum. <laughs> yeah, yeah, if you ever want to do it, just hit me up. I'll tell you how to do it. Alright. Hold on. <laughs> just like... Oh, no! <laughs> yeah. Like, baseball's been around forever. There's so many players. Yeah, that's Undo true. the link. And it's hard. It I'm testing. Time. Katie is that's currently right. in the midst of taking her third really baseball IQ test. She expressed to me that she has interest in becoming smarter about baseball given the office that she works in. We talk about it a lot, but she doesn't always listen, which is fine. So I have created her some quizzes on the basic stats, history, players, ins and outs of baseball to help her out before the season gets started. Um, it's going, they've, they've been okay. There's lots of room for improvement, but that's why I think, uh-oh. Some of the questions aren't meant for her to know, but they're meant for her to get wrong and remember and keep locked in her brain forever. I've tried to give her a lifeline. 
but she'll get there. She just can't always overthink it, mm -hmm. overthink everything. Because I think you have more knowledge than you let yourself mm -hmm. believe. You did really well on the first one, I remember yeah, that. Yeah, I mean, not really yeah. well. Yeah. Her second one is still posted on the wall yeah, for... Really do not, do not, do not, no. Uh, no. Uh, it's uh, always room It could room. be better. <laughs> It, be it will better. be. So yeah. once come All Star break, we'll re-give her these tests, see how much she's, how much she's improved, which I suspect will be a lot. Um, in history of MLB, who, how many players are part of the 3,000 hit club? So like 32. Are you kidding me? My first guess. You swayed me away from that too. Where on the field is the warning track? Warning tracks in the outfield. It's like the dirt brown little track before the wall mm -hmm. so when a, 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 an outfielder is running back to catch a fly ball or a home knows run he knows the right that the wall is coming up because he's running on dirt now and not grass pretty smart. smart yep so that's in the outfield i'm sure you'll notice that now you got 13 very easily al has a dh nl doesn't pitchers can hit Pickoff attempt, you also did pick the right answer. When a pitcher is trying to throw out a base runner, so he'll throw it back to either the first, right, right, right. second or third baseman, hold him close, or try to catch him in a pickle. Pickle. So you, you ended strong, you got 14 and 15 correct. But not your best showing today. One, two, three, four, five, six, eight. Eight out of 15. Which I think, is that your last one? Yeah, I'm being I'm pretty consistent on the. I think that's a 56 percent. Yeah. <laughs> hey, at least I'm consistent, right? <laughs> Next week's my week. I'll study up.